And on the subject of compatibility, well, there's the back catalog of games, which numbers in the tens of thousands, with a shocking number of old games still being playable on modern hardware. I fired up 1602 AD, a game from almost 1602 AD, on my Windows 10 PC with a Titan RTX on it with minimal tinkering required. That's crazy. So we're actually working on a collab with good old games right now to show this off. Make sure you're subbed so you don't miss it. On the subject of tinkering, Windows games, particularly the older ones, allow for a ton of it with large communities that have built everything from their own servers for multiplayer to mods that alter visuals or gameplay elements and even mods that change the genre of the original title. Fun fact for you young kids out there, Dota used to be a custom map in Warcraft 3. Finally, there's the advantage that comes naturally with being the incumbent gaming platform, support. Want to try out the hottest new peripherals like brand new graphics cards, VR headsets, haptic feedback vests? Odds are excellent that the Windows software is going to be much more polished than what's available for other platforms. That is, if anything exists for them at all. RTX real-time ray tracing on Mac? Please. At $75, the Razer Ornata Chromax is one of the most expensive boards here, but not without reason. It wins the award for best unboxing experience and the product itself feels quality too. There's well thought out slots for routing the braided cable on the underside and the absolutely plush wrist rest stands out as clearly the best in show. It features full RGB lighting under what Razer calls mecha mechanical key switches, which unfortunately is where things start to fall apart a little bit for the Ornata Chromax. Marketing aside, these are essentially rubber dome key switches, with the large stem of the keys being used to stabilize its keystrokes. That means that there is a squishy bottom out for each keystroke with a rather heavy actuation force. So unless RGB is your top priority, it's hard to recommend because for this price, I would have hoped to see actual mechanical switches.